Hello students, welcome back to the video blog. In this uh, particular video tutorial, we'll be discussing a program called as write a C++ program that outputs the contents of its environmental lists. So environment list is nothing but a set of variables that are predefined in your operating system. So if you want to have a look at various envir environment list for Unix operating system, you can, what you can do is you can just say man nvron. So when you say man nvron, all the list of uh, envir environment lists will be displayed. So user, the name of the logged in user, login, log name, the name of the logged in user, home, the user's login directory, lang, the locale, path, the sequence of directories, prefixes, that has sh, pwd, the present working directory, shell, the path name where the shell is executing, and so on and so forth. There are list of such things. So uh, essentially, how to have a look at such uh, the properties of environment variables using a C program. That is what we'll be demonstrating in this uh, video tutorial. The program is a short program. And you can see there are two uh, character array that we have defined. One is character star star PTR, and one is external character star star environ. So environ, the only difference between these two declaration is the variable environ is marked as extern and the variable PTR is not marked as extern. It is simply a character. So you are already familiar with the keyword extern. It simply means you are declaring environ variable in this scope, but it is defined elsewhere. The difference between declaration and de definition is obvious. You declare to, in to um, notify the compiler that this is the variable which you will be using in this particular scope. Definition is what is the meaning of that variable? That is the definition of it. It's similar to function definition and function declaration. So environ is defined somewhere else. Where is it defined? It is defined in unistd.h. It can also be, def uh, we have not included that header file here. We have included standard lib.h. In both of these header files, environ variable is defined. So we have this ptr, which is a local variable. All we need to do is use this variable and for every value that is defined for environ in standard lib.h, we are going to copy the value into the PTR and print that value here. That is what we are doing in this uh, program. This is a very simple program. And here, uh, what uh, star star PTR is nothing but a two-dimensional character array. Star star environ is again a two-dimensional character array. So every column, uh, sorry, the every row is one env environment variable. Row number one, environment variable number one. Row number two, environment variable number two. Row number three, environment variable number three, and so on. So let us have a look at the execution of this program. How uh, does it look like? So gcc prog 5a dot c minus o prog 5a. Compiled dot slash prog 5a. Enter. So you can see the list of all the environment variables here. There are various lists. You can always go through this list. Uh, do a man page of environ and you will get the list of things. So I'll, I can show you some of them. See the global lang, lang is English US. Home is slash home Aditya. English India. Genome desktop session is this is deprecated somehow. So these are some of the variables, path environment variables, and so on and so on. This is the path environment variable. User is Aditya and so on. Yeah, that is the end of this tutorial. Thank you.